But in, and when we talk about second chances, you know, you were on fire with LA Knight, Max Dupree happened, and then LA Knight came back. And I'm curious what the conversation with Triple H looked like when LA Knight was allowed to come back as we know him now. Well, let me just uh, go ahead and say this. I'm pretty sure I was I was fired and it just hadn't officially happened yet. Um, um, <laughs> but without getting into too many details, some things happened. I don't remember what it was, but some things happened. <laughs> Uh, and then I had gotten a, uh, a, 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 a FaceTime. Hey, uh, you know, we, we want to keep you around. We want to do this, this, that, whatever. And, uh, okay, cool. Good. So somehow I'd been saved from being thrown off the cliff. At least this is my interpretation of it. Sure. Maybe I'm incorrect. I don't know. Uh, and so eventually just things kind of worked out. And uh, I, I think that maybe, again, maybe some of the testament to why things are working the way they are and the people reacting the way they are is because one of these was not me and I didn't know who it was. And one of these is very much just me. Like, I don't have to think about L.A. Night. I don't really have to dig in like, what is this? Who am I? What am I doing? I just go and do because it's just me heightened. You and I have been to a party together. I think you've been to one of my parties. I am a heightened personality at the party. So like to me, my personality on TV is a, it's an amalgamation of me at a party and me in an argument. And when you <laughs> put those two together, you've got LA Knight. 